It's your girl Angela at Angela Southern Comfort. To you is my homemade. Okay, on top of the stove, I've melted a stick and a half of uh, salted butter and, a cup, and also a half a cup of vegetable oil. So we have a stick and a half of salted butter and a half a cup of ve vegetable oil that I've melted together on top of the stove. That's done. Now, in the meantime, we want to incorporate our ingredients, okay? So let me start here. Let me move my eggs over here. We'll get to those in just a moment. That's just my bowl. Let me just get to what I gotta get to. Now, we're gonna start with our yellow cornmeal mix by Quaker. So far, what I've done is I've poured up two cups, okay? So we're gonna pour that in here, and I'm gonna tell you right now, I'm about to make a, uh, pour in another cup, okay? So totally, that's the whole thing. So you get four cups in there. The reason why we're doing four cups is because I'm making a large quantity of cornbread. All right? All right, next, I have about a half a cup of sugar, white granulated sugar, okay? All right, then I have a cup and a half of whole milk. All right, pour that on over in here. Now if we need more milk, we'll get more milk. All right, push all these things back to the side. Next, what we're going to add is, we're going to pour together before I get some cornmeal, we're going to pour together some self-rising flour, okay? Now, here's the first cup. I'm going to pour together my second cup. Make sure I level it off right. I got a second cup. Alright, so there we are. We're done with that. Let me set that to the side over here. Alright, next I'm going to bring over to my melted butter. Alright, and my melted oil. So here's my melted butter and my melted oil. I'm going to go ahead and we're just going to pour that all over in here just like that. Nice and hot, right? Let me wipe this off. So we don't want that dripping down in our stove when we're cooking. Now we use that same skillet to cook the cornbread in the oven. Okay, I'll tell you that right now. So now we're gonna move forward. I'm gonna put my bowl right here, my spoon. So what I'm gonna do is go ahead and stir up this right quick. All right. I have my oven set on 375 degrees. All right, for my cornbread sure to mix the ingredients very well. All right, just want to get those going. Be sure to stir completely under the bottom to get all the ingredients well mixed, okay? All right, next, I have three eggs, three large eggs, so just gonna keep these here for a minute. And the reason why I have a nine by 13 pan there is in case I have a, you know, more batter left, I can pour it over in there and have the skillet going in the oven with cornbread. And I can use the nine by 13 if I have enough cornbread batter left. Okay, this is the way my mother, my grandmother make their cornbread. All right, very good. Sit this in the sink so we can get it ready for the dishwasher. All right, next, what we want to do is we're going to put some self-rising cornmeal. All right, so just went out and got this. All right, I'll open this up. And you can use whatever you choose as far as cornmeal mix, whatever brand. I prefer, honey, I'm about to put a hole in this bag. I prefer Martha White self-rising cornmeal mix, okay? I'm gonna put a couple cup, uh, cup fulls in here. So here's our first cup. I'm gonna get this first cup. I'm gonna level it off real good. It doesn't have to be perfect. Alright, here's our first cup. Mama's love and stuff, honey. Way more. Okay. Okay. Alright. Now, my mother and my grandmother, whenever they would make cornbread, let's set this aside for a moment. 
whenever they would make cornbread and they melt their butter and their oil, they would take that same skillet and put the cornbread batter over there and um, cook their cornbread. Mm -hmm. Now you can also, in place of uh, milk, whole milk, you can use buttermilk. All right, and that's just what mama's gonna add. When you have a little bit too much batter, it's all right, honey. Just get you some buttermilk. You have some buttermilk. And that's what mama gonna get us, some buttermilk. Y'all stay with me. So just put some whole milk in there. Y'all stay with mama, honey. I need the children over here for a minute. Let mama get this buttermilk up. Let's just put it in and it's feeling good, baby. Let's get close. Let's get a little close. Let's get a little close. Let's get 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 so what we're gonna do is we're just gonna pour this buttermilk over in here. Buttermilk is very thick. Okay. I might level it off with some more regular milk, whole milk. Get my daughter to get me. Shayla, mama needs your help, buddy. Mommy, some more milk, please. Mm, you can smell the buttermilk in here. You know, honey, Mama gonna bring you a dish that's easy and simple to do, honey. Mm, smells so good. Smell that buttermilk. So I'm going to add me a little bit more whole milk in here and give my daughter my cup. Thank you, baby. Just give mama about half a cup. Thank you, honey. Y'all know we family over here, honey. I ain't about to stop and be pretty with y'all. I'm about to take y'all straight up. Mama got the children in here working for the one time. Amen. That's what we about to do. All right. So as soon as we pour the next remainder of the milk in here in the batter, honey, we're going to go ahead and put it in our, in our skillet and get this cornbread in this oven. All right. Let me see if that's gonna be enough. The baby girl don't like mama some milk. No, that ain't gonna be enough, sweetie. I need a hand. All right. Let mama see. Let mama see. Hold on. All right. So now, mama, we got the milk, honey, and we gonna be straight. Thank you, Shayla. My baby don't like me seeing you on camera. All right. So we got our cornbread ready, honey. She ready. She ready going that oven, honey. And she gonna cook for about, mm, probably about 35, 40 minutes. And it'll be done. And I'm gonna come back to you, honey, and show you what mama's homemade cornbread looks like, honey. And you know I gotta get a taste, because cornbread don't last long in this household, honey. As soon as the children find out mama done made some cornbread, honey. My kids got all kind of nicknames for me. They call me Gina for Martin. They call me Big Mama, Sugar Mama, Little Mama, Aunt Bam. Look, mama gonna come back to y'all and taste some cornbread and bribe it, honey. Because if I say cornbread too loud, honey, they gonna take all the cornbread. And mama needs some cornbread, alright? Now, honey, you know this is good with a good old bowl of homemade soup, honey. Or vegetable beef stew, honey. Mm -mm 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 -mm. So this is enough batter. Be sure to get around the size of that bowl, honey. And be sure to stir from the bottom. So this is gonna show y'all what we got to do. Use that skillet that we melted our butter and our oil in. See all that butter? Mm-hmm. Sure enough it is. Yes, honey. This is how mama do it. She do it just like mama and grandma. Yes, I do. What we got to do is we got to pour our batter over in this skillet. And we're gonna make us some cornbread. You don't need the oil because you already melted the oil in the box. Right. 
what you into tonight Girl, I'm with you oh, wait, this one. Girl, it's simple I'm trying to be this J&B on the good 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 What's up with Ooh. you? I need you responding to what the hooks say right. Them hoes that get so tipsy And honestly start right. to look so now, crazy I'm in the VIP, girl I'm in the pole where they tip I'm always gonna need you with me You hustle harder than Nipsey she love my records, she keep them spinning like frisbees Ball is all in attendance, so I'm just hoping you pick me It's a gamble, I'm hopping out of a phantom I'm trying to eat you like all this shit in my pantry I'll call you then to promote us after my second hand appears on number 13 That's what we gonna do We gonna pour that all over in there, honey Where's my ice cream? Where's my ice cream? Where's my ice I told y'all, honey, don't y'all throw nothing away. You paid for this stuff, honey. Get your money. Look, and you can take cornbread if you're not going to use it right away, honey. And if you have one of those vacuum seal machines that they have on QVC, honey. Or you can go to Best Buy. And, uh, not Best Buy. Uh, Bed Bath & Beyond and buy it. You can go to Walmart. And, honey, you can put this in one of those bags on the machine and seal it tight. Put it in your freezer, honey. And then when you're ready to use it, honey, you can take it out the freezer. And, um, you know, don't cook it, of course, but you can take it and freeze it, you know, in your good pie pan or whatever type of pan that you would bake it in and just freeze it. Or get you one of them 9 by 13 pans down at the uh, Walmart, honey, that we bake in. Go down there and get you one of them, honey, a small pan or whatever size, honey, and store your cornbread. And you put it in the freezer. And when you're ready, you take that bad baby out, let it room temperature, let it thaw for about two hours. Smack that bad baby on over in that oven, honey, and let him go on and cook, all right? Don't y'all be throwing the, extra, right, the way that uh, extra money in here. This is money, honey. Y'all see me getting that money out that bowl? Mm-hmm, sure it is. Getting all that money right there in that bowl. I'm not about to rinse none of my money down the drain. Mm-mm. No, Miss Angie ain't about to play with you when it comes to the money, honey. I'm a little funny when it comes to the money, honey. I'm going to need the money. And I'm gonna need the food. Amen. <laughs> Amen. All right. I try to get all the money I can get. Y'all see any more money? Y'all don't see no more money. All right. Well, I'm gonna look for a little bit more. Okay. Mm-hmm. All right. So that's what we have. I'm gonna set this over here to go to the dishwasher. Honey. All right. Gotta get my money. All right. So then we're gonna level this on off. Let's level it off. And voila, look at that. Honey, we about to put this on over in the oven. And bam, she gone. She gone to the oven. All right. Mama, thank y'all for watching. And listen, Mama, come back as soon as it's done, okay? Okay, everyone. So our homemade cornbread is done and finally out of the oven. It's very hot. So here I have them sitting on top of a rack. And what I did when they came out of the oven is I went and took a stick of butter and just went over the top of it giving such a beautiful finish on top so now you know you can also melt some butter a stick of salted butter like a half a stick and you can put some honey with it and you can drizzle on top of your cornbread that'll be very good too so now what mama gonna do honey mama's gonna get a small piece of this cornbread y'all didn't hear me say that give me one minute let mama get her a piece of this cornbread because i didn't want my children to know that i was gonna cut this cornbread so y'all give mama a minute. I told y'all the children love cornbread in this house, folks. All right. So what we gotta do is mama's gonna take a little piece of this cornbread right here. I'm gonna show y'all. Oh, honey, it's very hot. I told y'all it's very, very, very hot. It came out this oven. You know, I don't like tearing up the cornbread when it's hot, honey. I don't want to burn myself. Well, mommy ain't got time to be over here wrestling with the cornbread, but we're going to get it in for the one time. Ooh, this bad baby is hot. Y'all see the goodness of that cornbread? Come on, I'm going to get it out this pan. It is smoking hot, honey. Let me get my crumbs because y'all know I paid for them, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm about to get all that there because I paid for them. And so when you pay for them, you eat them. You don't throw nothing away, honey. Mm-mm. Let me put this in the sink. Then I'm going to show y'all the goodness of that cornbread, honey. Can y'all get a good picture of that? Mm-hmm. Yes, honey. Mama about to eat that cornbread. It's moist. Mm. I'm going to flip that camera, honey. It's moist. 
it's buttery tastes just like grandma cornbread mm. and it's hot mm -hmm. get them crumbs off top mm -hmm. all you need is some beef stew a roast or some soup that's all you need let me make sure y'all see that one more time y'all see that my mom took the pen let the children see honey for the one time can y'all see the beautiful picture mm-hmm yep i want y'all to see me eat this too mm. Mm -mm -mm. Mm. 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 you're gonna love this cornbread video this is damn good.